Richard Sandoval is single-handedly changing the image of Mexican food, moving it firmly into the upscale cuisine sector. How and he's sir? taken some Good. time this morning from his 11, yes, 11 yes. restaurants to show us how Mexican can be modern and magnificent. Buenos dias. Good morning. Morning. How are you? We're doing great. I know that you're going to give us a little lesson in something called sope. A lot of people think Mexican <laughs> food, they think burritos, chimichangas. Right. What are sopes? Sopes are like finger foods that you find in the markets in Mexico. It's actually one of the dishes we have at Ketsi, the new restaurant we just opened at the Four Seasons. Uh, you know, one of the most beautiful resorts I've, I've been to, actually. The one in, in Mexico? Punta Mita, Mexico. Yes, beautiful. exactly. I've actually been there. Oh, and one quick question. With all the restaurants you are opening up, how, how are you able to do this in this time? We hear of this time of recession, how places are closing, but you seem to be, you, how many do you have open? You've got two opening up in the spring, correct? I've got two more opening in Santa Monica. We're opening maybe at the Ritz Carlton. Yeah, so we got a couple of things working on. Fantastic. Good for you, chef. Better stay busy in these, yep, that's in these for sure. All right, let's get to the competition. All right, so here, you know, you have your masa right here. Okay. What is, is what, what's in this? This is the, the corn flour. So what we Just used to corn make, flour. Yeah, what we used to make corn tortillas. With a little water? A little bit of water, a little okay. bit of salt. So you then, shape it in a little ball. Shape, yeah, and then you put it on the palm of your hand. Uh-huh, and you and start then, to flatten. And then you start to press it. Okay. Peggy, have you ever made one of these before? Never. You had an advantage? No, no, I'm Cuban. I'm She's not Mexican. Latin, so she, I, actually, that does I, have I've an advantage. I've never made a sopes, though. <laughs> And what you want to do is you want to get them back to mix. We'll, how, you, how skinny? Is this too skinny? That seems no, that's a little fine. too skinny. Yeah? You, want to, you want to put it in the pan now, you know, with a little bit of oil. Is it really hot? Um, not too hot. I mean, you want to make sure that it's sizzling. Oh, we we'll take yours. Okay. Good, good. Uh, you're winning. That's Advantage, nice. Raggy. That's nice, You're going to be okay? And we're going to do it. I think okay? I still you got feeling it. You feeling the heat here? I still got it, Rags. <laughs> You'll see. We want to just, you know, do it for about 20, 30 seconds just to make sure you get some browning on there. Yep. Get around the oil, and then, and then what we're going to do is we're going to take them out of here, and you need to pinch the edges. So it's going it's to be your your, your, uh, your canvas where you're going to put your. We want it to look your, like that eventually. Product, you want okay, eventually. so let's start pinching. So let's get them back to you. Like okay. We'll put it back in your plate here. All right. Maggie, it might would be a little like hot. To, would you like me to put a model here so you can actually see? Hi, yeah, yeah. I want you to have you are all so the advantages. Get your this is not very kicked. manicure friendly. I'll tell you that. Oh, that's you're going to get your hands very dirty. So you got to want to pinch the edges, and then what we'll do. Wow. Very hot. <laughs> if you don't want to burn your hands, but you can also no, use you know, too late a nice towel and just uh, a paper towel. Okay, so we so pinch the edges. Now give them back to me, and we'll toss it in the hot Still oil. Still working right here. there, buddy. No, I'm okay. I'm so finished. Make sure you do it okay. I think I need the old spatula here. Okay, now you put them back in the. Oh, now you deep fry. Now you deep fry, deep fry. To, to, to finish cooking because. You know, you want to make sure it's still soft. You can pinch, you know, pinch the edges. All right, so we have to hurry up here. Let's just show how we top one. Okay, so let's just take them out of here real quick. We have 20 seconds, Chef, so let's just top one here. We All put right. a little bean. Let me give one to you real fast, too. Yep, okay. You have some a spoons little... right here. You know, put a little black bean puree. What's this, cabbage with the uh, corn? Little yeah, a little corn. Spectacular. A little salsa. A little cremita. And we put a little, corn, a little uh, chicken tinga on there. Beautiful. You can get this recipe on the web, earlyshow.cbsnews.com. <laughs> See you tomorrow, Jules. Bye, guys.